Hello, hello YouTube, Josh Takes Back with another great tutorial and today's tutorial is about how to fix attempted switch from DPC blue screen on Windows. This error may happen on Windows 11, Windows 10 or other Windows operating system. So it will show you a DPC error. So to solve this problem, we are going to see five solutions. So let's start from solution number one. So the first solution for this error or the attempted switch from DPC blue screen on Windows would be, which is updating all the drivers. Updating all the drivers may help you to solve this problem. So open your browser, any browser. In my case, I'll use Google Chrome. You can use Microsoft Edge or any browser. Then after you open the browser, type here Intel Assistance. So here Intel Assistance, then open that. So it will give it will lead you to Intel Driver and Support Assistance. Then open that. Then Intel Driver and Support Assistance here download now. So download this Intel uh, Driver and Support Assistance. So it will it will update all the drivers that are needed for your computer. And as you can see here, th this application is supported for Windows 7, Windows 8, 8.1. Windows 10, Windows 11. So you can update all the drivers on your computer by downloading this driver and support assistance of Intel. So this helps you to solve the problem. And if downloading this and updating all your drivers cannot solve your problem, then the second solution will be repairing the corrupted files. So in order to repair the corrupted files, again, we are going to click here the search icon. Then type here CMD. So you'll find here the command prompt. So right click on it and select run as administrator. Then confirm by selecting here yes. And here the CMD is open as an, as an administrator. So in order to repair the corrupted files, type here SFC space slash scan now. So after it happens, then press enter and it will start processing in order to repair the corrupted files on your computer. So wait patiently until it will finish the process. So here the SFC is kind of completed. So after it's completed, type here exit and close your uh, command prompt or CMD. Then check whether the problem related with DPC is solved or not. So if the problem is still occurring, then try the next solution. The third solution will be scan for virus in malware. This also help you to stop the error which is happening. So in order to scan for virus, click here the search icon again and type here window security. Security then open the window security. Then you will find here virus and threat protection then open that and you will find scan options. So select the scan options and perform here a full scan for your computer. Select full scan here and select scan. Now. So it may take some time based on your computer uh, file. So wait patiently until the scanning will be completed. And after the scan completed, then remove or delete all the viruses or malwares on your computer. So the fourth solution for this video will be running a memory diagnostic. So this also help you to stop the error or the DPCU blue screen failure. So in order to do that again, click here the search icon and type here run. And here is the run, then select run. And type here this information and select here OK. Then it will give you check your computer for memory problems. So memory problem can cause your computer to lose information or stop working. So click this restart now and check the problem recommended. So after the restart, if the problem is still occurring, then the fifth solution will be run driver ver verifier. So in order to run driver verifier, again, click here the search icon and type run. Then open the run and type verifier under this box. 
then select here OK and it will ask you a confirmation select yes then after that here select at a socket standard setting select the first radio box and select here next so after that it will give you select what driver to verify so automatically select unsigned driver so select the first option it will automatically select the unsigned driver and it will help you to fix the dpc error or the blue screen error so i'm going to select next and in my case it says no asset no unsigned driver have been found in your case if it is found an unsigned driver it will fix using this driver verifier so select here ok and close your uh, driver verifier so these are the methods on how you can fix a tainted switch from dpc blue screen on windows computer and if this video is helpful please like subscribe share to your friends thank you for watching just take out